We've had a, quite a number of people concerned about the mode of action of pawpaw and how it can work in order to facilitate chemotherapy or help to maintain the effectiveness of chemotherapy. And actually, it, it's quite simple. Uh, chemotherapy will run its course, and after a while, it doesn't work anymore. The patient becomes refractory to the effects of the chemo. The cancer becomes resistant. And clinically, this is called multiple drug resistance because a number of anti-cancer agents will not work any longer. And what's happened is that the cancer cells have all developed a little pump in the cell membrane. And this little pump will pump the drug out of the cell before the drug can stay in the cell and kill the cancer cell so that the cell survives. And it doesn't make any difference what type of chemotherapy you take. The switching to another drug doesn't work because the pump is multiple drug resistant and it pumps all compounds out. But one of the structural features that that it requires, it seems, is a benzene ring in the structure of the anti-cancer material. The pawpaw cetogenins do not have a benzene ring. They have what we call tetrahydrofuran rings. Otherwise, they're just long chain fatty acids. And so they're not pumped out by the pump. So furthermore, they inhibit the pump mechanism. The pump requires energy, and the energy comes in the form of adenosine triphosphate, or ATP. So by inhibiting ATP production, which is the mode of action of the pawpaw materials, in the mitochondria as well as in the cell membranes and ADH oxidase system, we end up uh, decreasing the ATP concentration so that the pump won't work. And so there isn't any energy to run the pump. So if we would give pawpaw with chemo at that stage, we would allow the chemo to stay in the cell longer. And maybe we can restore the effectiveness of chemotherapy by giving pawpaw with the chemo in refractory patients. Okay. Furthermore, if we would give the pawpaw earlier on with the chemo, we would prevent the, the resistance from developing because the pawpaw would help to kill off the resistant cells as they develop. So it makes sense to me to give pawpaw with chemo to prevent drug resistance from developing. And pawpaw alone will work, but the two together, it ought to work synergistically.